Good afternoon, Master Tanaka. Good afternoon. Good afternoon, friend Elena. I am Master Kwanin, and as always, I'm filled with joy. God's truth is always present in every word that is being conveyed to you, so that you can all generate this process of joy, increasingly conscious in your own being. You are always interpreting that an earth plane is only a plane in matter. Even many say, Master Quanin, I don't have a true perception of the meaning of energy. So within me, I even generate a decision that I will be focused on the earth plane. So I will observe matter. And within that, I will be generating decisions. So that matter is always turned in my favor. What I'm putting into words here is that all of you are already energetic beings. So even if you don't have a true perception, a clear perception of the meaning of energy, but when you simply accept this information as a truth, then naturally you are turning your whole process of understanding towards your energetic form. That's why I say that when you begin to carry out procedures, as some of you already know, such as the Kuan Yin technique, then naturally this technique begins to guide you and brings each of you a process of self-knowledge, making you open up to realizing that energy is always being shaped by you, even if you're not visualizing it. But you know that this is true. Because when you are doing the technique, the technique brings you this understanding. The technique makes you, within everything that you determine for yourself, come to understand that your process of choices is being guided, is always returning to what you have determined. That's why it's said that when you're using the technique and you're immersed in it, you bring all your desire into it. Then naturally this desire is also involved in the technique. And everything that may have been generating through a process of incomprehension is remolded within you. And you start to generate a creative process that is increasingly geared towards this self-understanding. So what should you always understand? On an earthly level, you do have various techniques. Some even say methodologies. But look at the methodology when you carry out a study and you really understand what is there in that study. You incorporate that study into you. So of course you can use these methodologies knowing exactly what you are generating in yourself. So, when this clarity is naturally present, you can use the resources you say you already know. But remember, every technique must always be geared towards a process of self-understanding. Don't think that a technique is generated for you to use only on another being. What you must always understand is that everything you use must be recognized as your way of being. So when you use these methodologies, when you use the techniques, then naturally what you're doing is a process of self-knowledge. It's a process of self-education. But as we are always oriented towards this technique within our work, which has been given to all of you, I'm putting these words here so that you are always aware of using the Kuan Yin technique in all the situations that may arise. Many of you are still separating your life into areas, separating your life into situations, which is why I'm putting these words here. Naturally, the technique, when you become aware that you are a whole being, then when you perform this technique on yourself, it is restructuring, reorienting everything in your being. That's why all the areas, all those parts become integrated, become whole, 
and you realize that this wholeness will always be manifesting within everything you're doing. That's why when you look at yourself and generate a process of self-understanding, what are you accomplishing? You are recognizing this integrity of your being and you are opening yourself up to a process of experiences. Because what is always asked? You are all beings full of energy. You are all living a process of self-oriented experiences. But what happens is that often because you are distracted, this self-orientation isn't being fully perceived, isn't being understood. And when you start to carry it out as part of your routine process, when you even take on the Kuan Yin technique as your way of being, what you are opening up to is precisely accepting this integrity of your being. You are opening up to accepting that the process of self-indoctrination is always a truth and is generated by you. With these words, I say goodbye. Thank you very much. Thank you very much.